Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about modeling and control of permanent magnet synchronous generator based energy system with battery charging. This example shows how to use a permanent magnet synchronous generator, simply is called as PMSG to charge a battery. Ok, here what are the contents in this presentation? Introduction, Simlink model, field oriented control system, system simula simulation result from Simscape logging, simulation result from scopes and also MATLAB, Simlink products and Simscape uh, electrical toolbox. Here is some small introduction about this example. This example shows how to use a permanent magnet signal generator to charge a battery. Here some uh, subsystem and sources, source blocks are uh, used for this design. An ideal angular velocity source is used to maintain the rotor speed constant and the control subsystem uses field oriented control to regulate the torque of the PMSG and the torque reference is also obtained as a function of uh, DC link voltage. The initial battery state of charge is 25% and the scope subsystem also uh, contains scopes that allow, allow you to see the simulation result. Okay, when this you, you using for this uh, type of example, I, I have verified, I have um, gone through this uh, journal called um, uh, um, uh, article called Monitoring and Control of Permanent Magnet Synchronous Generator Based Wind Turbine Applied to the Battery Charging. Here, Misaf, Mayav, and Hadi Bhakti uh, et al. Uh, um, proposed uh, monitoring and control of uh, permanent, uh, permanent magnet synchronous generator based wind turbine applied to battery charging energy sources and all. Okay, based on that, um, uh, these examples are available in this MATLAB uh, MATHOX website. Here also, also you can get this article and, uh, and cite this uh, article. By using this example also, we can uh, do this uh, work. Here, here this is a Simlink model that is a lithium mag uh, the, um, uh, battery charges uses uh, permanent magnet synchronous generator to charge a battery. Here, um, this model, this battery, is battery subsystems are used. These control subsystems uh, having the field oriented control to regulate the torque of the PMSG and torque reference is obtained as a function of DC link voltage and scopes for blocks contains this allow to see the simulation result etc. Okay, this is a control subsystem of uh, this field oriented control here the measurement blocks and outer loop control and um, uh, current control loop and pwm training and waveform generator it is three phase and two level uh, waveform generator uh, based on that and this control subsystem is used uses um, foc control to regulate the torque of the uh, permanent magnet synchronous generator okay here also uh, the modeling parameters you uh, reusable code by using this ma modeling parameters um, uh, for PMSG battery charging is available in this example by using this example you can set the general parameters like for nominal power nominal torque and nominal speed and stator uh, inductance uh, based on the axis and stator resistance and permanent magnet, magnet flux linkage also you can uh, uh, vary the parameters by using the exa example and also you can uh, give the battery data for example nominal voltage and internal resistance and ampere evaporating here also by using uh, this uh, reusable code we can set this we can check the analysis of PMSG battery charging uh, example here the, when the scopes a system by using the subsystem you can see measure the rotor speed battery voltage and requested torque versus measured torque and also calculate the state of charge and power transferred and the state of the uh, current and voltage and phase currents also you can uh, analyze by using this simulink subsystem here uh, uh, along with the simulink uh, simulink uh, scopes result by using result explorer you can also uh, get the waveform of uh, this uh, permanent magnet uh, synchronous uh, generator based uh, EV charging example you can see the uh, torque versus time that is a generator torque and the DC link voltage and battery state of charge and also this plot source the generator torque and the battery voltage and the state of charge by using this example and also by using interactive result explorer you can analyze the output that is requested torque versus measured torque and all this is the result and this uh, snapshot shows similar result explorer using these results plots along with this plot you can see average value uh, for this VAC and battery reference converter voltage reference converter ideal angular velocity source and uh, IPM is some um, uh, uh, diagram and also mechanical rotational reference VMSG sensing VDC sensing current sensing IABC sensing torque and sensing uh, power also you can see by using this uh, result explorer Okay, now let us see the example for the simulation. These are simulation model we are getting uh, with this MathWorks, uh, MathWorks website. 
this is a permanent micro signals generator battery charging model this is our battery this is my battery blocks uh, model a battery uh, if you select the infinite or the uh, battery charge capacitor parameter the block models a battery as a series internal resistance and a constant voltage source if you select finite uh, uh, for battery charge capacity parameter the block models a battery as a series internal resistance plus charge dependent voltage source by using this uh, 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 equation that is v equal to v nominal voltage into state of charge uh, by one, uh, 1 minus beta into 1 minus state of charge here where uh, SOS is the state of charge and v is the nominal voltage coefficient beta is calculated to satisfy the user defined data by uh, the point that is ampere ampere hour rating and voltage rating here how it is set by using this main settings block you, you can set the v nominal voltage and uh, also you say select the internal resistance uh, ampere power rating and we have volt v1 when the charge is a h1 in this manner you can uh, set this parameter this is a dynamic and also also by using this uh, um, a code modify the param parameter code here itself you can modify the parameters it is also available in this example to change the generator general generator parameters and battery data and control parameters here itself you can change the values for nominal for, for example nominal power uh, nominal torque nominal speed and state are d uh, axis inductance and q axis inductance and the state are resistance for pace nominal voltage and control parameters like uh, proportional gain uh, gain id controller integrator gain id controller and proportional gain iq controller integrator gain iq controller in this manner uh, pi controller uh, uh, pd controller you can use for this um, uh, for this control parameters uh, for analysis purpose you can use this code then uh, uh, this is a scope block in this close scope block you can analyze by various uh, scopes uh, re uh, regarding with the rota speed battery voltage requested torque versus measured torque and the state of charge calculation uh, phase current state of charge voltage and current and power transfer okay here these were av average value vsc that is average value voltage source converter block in this block represent the average value voltage source converter use three phase modulation wave input to the input to convert the electrical energy between the dc and ac sites here itself you can set the parameters called the loss parameters right fixed and you can also set the uh, coefficients for uh, loss and also profile you can uh, set uh, by using this right click we can get this Sim simscape block choices to variant implement of this block this block is the pmsg block yeah this uh, this block represent a pm permanent magnet synchronous machine with a sinusoidal uh, flux distribution here normally the winding type is by winding type here also you can select the predefined parameter section you can see we take the most times here itself you can set the parameter parameterization manager by using this block parameters management manager we can also select the manufacturers also for example uh, depending upon your hardware if you go for hardware implementation the selected manufacturer for pmsg abb uh, welder there, there are so many uh, companies are there so many vendors are there for example scm motors siemens and technic motors based on that based on the part see here also you, you need to get this part also here update block with selected park and compare block settings with the selected block if you say if we select for abb uh, baldor manufacturer you have to specify the part, part meter and also you are getting the web link in this manner you can uh, set the block set the pmsg generator block now uh, you set the uh, main settings called the winding type here you can see y wound type and delta wound type modeling fidelity number of pole pairs and uh, permanent magnet flux linkage parameterization in, in terms of flux linkage in terms of torque constant uh, in case of uh, back emf constant based on that you can analyze you observe the waveforms observed output you can make a uh, own uh, research by, by using this pmsg battery charging okay, here zero sequence and uh, what is the rotor angle differential also we can vary Okay, this is a block this is a uh, ideal voltage controller uh, ideal angular velocity uh, source this block represents the ideal source of angular velocity that generate a velocity differential at its terminal proportional to the physical input signal in this here r and c c, c s represent this a block block connections r and c are mechanical rotational conversing ports and the s is the physical signal port uh, through which control signal that drives the source is supplied here yeah, then uh, this uh, important subsystem is called um, control subsystem it has 
uh, outer loop control and measurement block and current control loop and PWM timing and waveform generator. In this waveform generator, here itself, uh, we can choose the PWM mode. Here this block implements the three phase, uh, two level uh, PWM timing and waveform generator. Here this is in this mode, we are selecting PWM mode. Also, you can vary continuous PWM or discontinuous PWM. Here, uh, you can use the continuous PWM. You set this uh, SVM, that is a space vector modulation or sinusoidal uh, uh, pulse width modulation. Uh, also, uh, you can vary and also you can set this uh, type of parameters, you can analyze. Here normally the sampling mode is uh, natural sampling. If you uh, if you select asymmetric and symmetric, just to observe the output waveform uh, according to the switching frequency. Here this is the current control block. In this current control block, you can see the PS, uh, PMSM is a current controller with a pre-controller block. In this block, mm, uh, this, uh, this block implements a discrete time-based PA, uh, PA-based PMSM current controller in the rotor of DQ reference frame with the internal feedback pre-control. In this manner, you can use. And the next one, uh, the outer loop control. And this is a measurement block. In this measurement block, you can, in this block, we have used uh, pole pairs versus low-pass low filter, filter block. Uh, this low pass filter blocks uh, models a low pass filter here itself we can set the parameters called gain time constant and lower saturation limit and also in a initialization from block input or a specify a parameter you can choose now let us see the simulation at the time of uh, running we are getting this type of output uh, by using this example that is a generated torque torque versus time this is uh, blue line indicates the measured and reference line indicate this orange line dotted line indicate that the reference this is a dc link voltage and time versus voltage and time versus uh, state of charge in terms of percentage you are getting this one and also by using the syscape uh, explorer you are getting uh, this type of output Here also you, you can modify the parameters, general parameters, battery data and control parameters. Here uh, you are getting this type of output. There is a state of charge, uh, charge. And this is your uh, VDC battery voltage. And this is your uh, torque, torque measured torque versus this is a requested torque. In this manner we are getting output by using this. Uh, example by using simscape result explorer we are also we, are, we, we can also uh, each and every block you can get the output this is your average value vsc that is your uh, modulated wave versus power dissipated uh, this is your time versus current and time versus voltage and time power versus power dissipated here this is a battery uh, uh, block e reference converter block And this ideal angular velocity. This IPS, IPM is some block. The PMS, PMSG. In this manner, we can see the output. There is where uh, measured versus angular position, angular velocity, and torque. Also, each and every every position you can see angular position, angular velocity, uh, i axis, uh, d value, i axis, i q axis value, phase splitter. This manner we can analyze by using interactive simscape explorer is are sensing vdc and sensing current and sensing ibfc and sensing torque and what is your uh, rpm 800 rpm were given so that it shows by using this interactive explorer also you can generate the code also import import the data also export export the data also print uh, print the screen and also use uh, the legend block and tools different types of tools are available here to uh, put the label, put the uh, colors, uh, color variation and all. So from the scope also you can uh, do. That is uh, by using this uh, Simscape Result Explorer, you can analyze the output and all. I hope uh, this example uh, getting um, uh, some idea about uh, PM by based on the PMSG generator um, uh, with the energy storage system uh, by using this uh, type of uh, battery charging. Here also by using this example, you modi modify the model parameters and also by using the re reusable uh, code, you can plot the result by using this type of permanent magnet synchronous generator. Thanks for watching. If you are new, if you are kindly subscribe my channel. Also, you can get this simulation simulation file in this description box available uh, with free of cost. But, but you are using this code for your education purpose. 
thanks for watching thank you uh, if you are like uh, like this video please uh, like and uh, share comments on my videos thank you for watch thanks for watching thank you so much